Attention! Watch out for EBT scams. EBT skimming devices are real. EBT cards are being skimmed, cloned, and used to fraudulently access Colorado SNAP and cash benefits. Card skimmers are put on ATMs and card readers at retail stores to skim or clone your EBT card information, including your PIN. Card skimmers are designed to look identical to a legitimate card reader. They take on the same appearance and often fit over the top or inside of card readers, leaving unsuspected users vulnerable to being skimmed. Once your EBT card is skimmed, criminals can access and use the funds on your EBT card because they have access to your card and PIN number. Here are a few ways to identify a card skimmer. The first way is to lightly pull up on the terminal. Skimmers are usually flimsy and will come right off. The second way to identify a skimmer is if the card reader simply appears too large compared to others. Layover skimmers have to be larger than the existing card reader to fit over it. The third way to identify a skimmer is if there is a pinhole camera on the card reader. Criminals add these cameras so they can record users entering their PIN. Oftentimes, these cameras are very small and incredibly hard to find, so the best thing to do is cover your hand when you are at a card reader or ATM. Covering your hand when at an ATM or card reader will prevent your PIN number from being captured on the camera. Now that you know how to look out for a card skimmer, you might be wondering, how do I protect my benefits? To help protect your benefits, change your EBT card PIN number frequently. When not in use, freeze your EBT card status to block transactions that may occur out of state or online. To freeze your EBT card status, utilize the EBT Edge mobile app or visit the EBT cardholder portal at ebtedge.com. If you suspect that your EBT card has been compromised, change your PIN number immediately. Consider replacing your EBT card as soon as possible or freeze the status of your card. You should contact your County Human Services office to report that your EBT card has been compromised. It is also recommended that you file an incident report with local law enforcement where the transaction or transactions have occurred.